Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Lalit Rao. I am film critic, member of Fipreski, and I am part of the Fipreski jury at 19th International Film Festival of Kerala 2014. Hossein Shabi is my guest today. I am going to speak to him, and with him is Mr. Nima, the interpreter. Uh, thank you very much, Mr. Shabi, for giving me a chance to speak to you. First of all, I would like to know how different is the Kerala audience from the audience of Fajr Festival, Fajr Film Festival in in Iran, where your film was shown for the first time. The most important difference is that uh, the audience here uh, are more interested and uh, receive better than uh, their Iranian counterparts. And as far as I have seen in all uh, uh, theaters, uh, seats are always fully occupied for each film, for every film. Each, every screening? Yes. Okay. What, what do you think could be the re re reason behind that? Because Indian people are cinema lovers and they like, they are interested in story and storytelling. Okay. And since they are very kind people, uh, that is why they uh, they don't uh, have any bias uh, before they uh, watch the film. So when they uh, come to a cinema before a screening, they are completely unbiased. I move on to my next question. Um, I read about Mr. Shabi's biography. Uh, he has done a lot of tele telefilms and he has studied music. So uh, my next question uh, to you, Mr. Shabi, is what was the idea behind moving from music to cinema? As a student, I didn't have much opportunity to work, to progress in the field of music. But even before I studied music, I had made some short films. And uh, uh, your film, A Bright Day, was very well received by audience. And Yeah, and as a journalist, what I observed was that they were quite impressed by the fight of this lady to get justice. So my question to you is, to you is can you tell more about this character? How did you uh, think of developing such a character of such a strong woman who would try to get justice? I have so far made uh, around 12 fields. Uh, in all of them, uh, the, uh, the hero, the prominent uh, character, is a woman. <laughs> Uh, 
در واقع من یکی از موضوعات چالش برانگیز و در واقع مسئله که خیلی برای مردم ایران درد و مسئله بجا انتخاب کرد یکی از موضوعات مهم جامعه ایران هم بجاش And in this film, I have uh, dealt with one of the most important, one of the uh, most challenging uh, topics in the society of Iran. Hmm. Okay. And um, the film was quite different from other Iranian films made in recent times. Especially in the use of uh, traveling, because most of the time um, all the actors are traveling in car. So I would like to know from Mr. Shabi, what was the reason behind showing a film? Uh, with a lot of travel uh, involved, especially in car and motorbike. Because the film deals with the, uh, is about uh, uh, the execution, uh, the execution of the man, and uh, we don't have much time. Okay. Uh, to that verdict. Uh, uh -huh. That is why the story, by itself, in its nature, has a kind of struggle. Mm -hmm. uh, has a kind of challenge in it. And since the space, the room in a car is limited, it somehow reminds us of the prison. And a limited uh, space a prisoner has. Okay. And uh, uh, what uh, I found in the film is that it's not only uh, the idea of justice, but idea of a strong woman character in the sense that she is fighting all alone with a lot of problems. And there are other women also who try to discourage her, who beat her. So what was the idea behind showing a very strong woman character and some weak uh, women uh, who uh, obstruct this woman? در مورد تلاش برای عدالت نیست بلکه یک جنبش هم اینه که زنی که تعلق کرده زن خیلی قویه این در تمام فیلم در مورد تلاش و تقلای و حتی کتکی میکنه حتی بایش بررفتاری میشه حتی در مقایسه با زنی دیگه که توی فیلم هستن اون بقیه زن ها زعیف ترن و این از اونها قوی تر دلیلش چی بوده که این رو خب چون این عاشقه این زن فقط خواهد ادالت نیست بخاطر عشق هم نیست because he is a, she is a lover this uh, woman mm -hmm. uh, does not struggle only for justice yeah. she struggles for love as well okay yeah and lastly i would like to know from mr shabi who are the actors who play these parts are they professional actors are they non professionals what is their background only the two major characters are professional the mm -hmm. others are non professional mm -hmm. actors Okay, so uh, this film was very well received and I, we hope that this would be shown in other festivals also. Thank you very much Mr. Shabi and all the best for other festivals. Thank you, Thank you for speaking to me.
Merci.